Hey everybody, this is Yvette. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome again. If you're returning, thank you so much for watching. I really, really appreciate it. Honestly, I love making these videos and I'm so excited for today's because today I'm gonna show you guys everything I got when I was thrifting this past week which I found some really, really amazing stuff and I'm so excited to share that with you guys. And I do also wanna share with you guys some of the stuff that I was able to find like earlier before that I was able to find that I still haven't shared because I found like so much good stuff. So if you love thrifting, stick around. Let me share with you guys everything, but first let's rewind and let me show you my little thrifting journey. I did go thrifting at Goodwill and found so many good things. They always have Target stuff there. So I always make sure to go through like all of that stuff because it's always new, brand new stuff that was just recently in the stores that just didn't get sold. So I'm always on there. I always love looking for whatever it is. You find so many good stuff to be honest. But obviously then you also have to go through and you'll find a lot of things that are just not what you're looking for which is totally fine so first i'll start with all of the clothes i was able to find the most recent one that i was able to find and i shared this in my spring outfits because this is my spring clothes is these pants which are some like corduroy kind of thing corduroy black pants only literally like five dollars like seriously these jeans and they fit me perfectly i've already i've worn them now and i'll share you with you guys a photo of how i put it together but they're literally so cute they're um, like some straight jeans so they fit perfectly too, just my size and i'm so excited i don't actually mind buying bigger jeans because i actually sew them up on the sides i mean i'm not like a professional or anything but it does get the job done and then i get to wear the jeans that I love, even if they don't fit me, but I can fix them up. All right, so now some of the older stuff that I got. So this sweater, again, thrifted. I think it's super cute. I wore this a lot in the winter, and I'll share with you guys a photo of it as well. And literally adorable, very that vintage, you know, kind of vibe. Older type of sweater, but so cute. So that was another one of my favorites. And then I got this oversized shirt, and it says Seattle with a little, um... Seattle with the little boats on it, which is so cute. You can see it's older because all of this is coming off. But I really love it. It's a perfect, like, oversized shirt. And then I have some shoes that match perfectly with all of these colors, which is adorable. So this one, again, very, very cute. I find a lot of my clothes, to be honest, in the guy section. It's probably one of my favorites. They always have some really good, like, oversized stuff for me. Or just even things I buy, buy in, like, smaller guys' clothes. Like, it's just perfect and then i got this sweater which is so cute and it, again vintage stanford what is it stanford on it stanford university it is a little bigger on me and i feel like the the neck of it is sort of wide you know when the shirts like fit like really wide on you <gasps> my stream okay <laughs> you know how they fit like really wide on you yeah that's how this one fits but other than that it's super cute like i really really like it it's perfect again for the winter i know we're going into the spring but those colder days a perfect cute little sweater all right up next are the shoes so i did get these again i shared this on my spring haul but these are literally the cutest shoes ever and i love them they're so adorable so many good ways to wear them and now i have a pop of color in my closet because all of my shoes are like i think almost all of them are white and as you can see i'll see if you guys can see that but there were only 20 bucks like literally $20 from Goodwill these shoes which were kept so well so I'm so excited for those then I got some Crocs which are so cute I freaking love Crocs so much I wear them so often I remember like back then when people would buy Crocs they're like oh that's disgusting and now now look at me I got Crocs and I've been thrifting them <laughs> like these are some dark blue ones which are super super cute I think I only got it for like 10 bucks or something like that. And then I put my little giblets on there, as you guys can see. And then a couple more Crocs, like I was showing you guys. I got these light gray ones, which are super cute. 
Again, my little, I don't even know what they're called. I always call them giblets. I don't think that's what they're called. But my little gem thingies. I got Reptar and Bad Bunny for both of these there. But these are so adorable. If you don't have Crocs, you definitely need to get some. All right, and another pair of shoes I was able to find are these New Balances, which is are so freaking cute. Uh, they're like a creamy kind of gray sort of beige color. Go with a lot of things. I think I had only gotten these for like 10 or 15 bucks, but so freaking cute. So if you don't have a pair of New Balances, or if you've never even heard of New Balance, you guys definitely need to look it up because they have so many cute shoes. Like I honestly need to buy more. But these are adorable. I really like them. And then I got some like miscellaneous stuff. So things that don't really fit in clothing or home. But I actually found a bunch, as you guys saw in the video, a bunch of these shoe protectors. So, or crease protectors. So these go into your shoes. So like say for example, these, as you can see, like they're all creased right here because this always happens. But if you put a pair of these inside your shoes while you're wearing them, they do not crease no more. So they literally had so many of these. Let me show you guys. They were only two bucks. Oh, there's a hair. Sorry. Two dollars for these things. And which is just so cool because like this one, it says if it's a, a woman's five to eight and then men's seven to 12. So yeah, you just slide these in and then your shoes do not crease. And then the one of the last things I got in the miscellaneous category is my little side deck, a little monito. He's so freaking adorable. I just want to share him because he's so cute. And I only got him for like a dollar. All right. And then last, I want to show you guys all of my home stuff that I was able to find. Actually, that little cork board over there, I actually thrifted that too, which is super cute. It has like all of my dream board stuff. I don't know if you guys have ever made one of those, but they're so much fun to make because you want to make your dreams come true. Don't ever give up on your dreams. Even though it's so crazy, it doesn't make sense. Like go for it. It doesn't matter what other people think or say. I just want to let you guys know, but let's go back to what I was talking about first place. It's all the home stuff I bought, which includes a very, very cute mirror I bought. And if you guys have are friends with me on Instagram, I did take a picture, a couple of pictures with that mirror because I'm just like in love with it. It is so cute. I need you guys to see it. Let me show you real quick. So this is the mirror I was talking about. It's so freaking cute. It has like all of this gold on there. The little flowers, the little petals. It does have a little crack thingy up here, but it's so freaking adorable. I really love it. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you guys see that I have posted pictures with this mirror just because it's so freaking cute. Look at it. So I'm so excited for our new house. We're going to see where I'm going to put this. If this was like bigger, honestly, I would have been like in love with it. It is smaller uh, compared to the size of my hand, but still freaking adorable. Okay, so now let's go to my little Goodwill corner because everything I got from Goodwill. Let me start with these, which are my curtains that I got again a while back ago. This is from that one brand. What is it? The Heath in Hand with Magnolia? I don't know, but they're super cute curtains. I got them for like 10 bucks. They're the really long, really pretty ones. And I'll show you guys like how much they originally are on Target because, girl, the deal I got on this one is so freaking good. And then I got, let's start up here. So I got these paintings again from Goodwill as well, which are so freaking cute. Again, another Target thing. And I'll show you guys the original of how much they actually cost because the price of these things are freaking insane. So go to your local Goodwill. <laughs> and then I got this pillow. I don't know where this pillow is from, but it's so freaking cute. It's like for the, the couch and stuff. And this one I recently got too, which was only four bucks. And it's like a really, really, really good tela, like, like sturdy, you know? And then lastly, my favorite, favorite thing I got is this chair. And I saw, as you guys saw in my little montage video, look at it, brand new. One of the, like the Goodwill ones. I got it for so cheap. I don't even, I think it was like probably like 30 bucks. But come on, like this, and I was doubting myself so much. Here, let me flip this around. Like I said, I was doubting myself so much because I was like, should I even buy this chair? Like, do I need it? You know, and then I went to go look at it. Right when we walked into the store, I looked at it and I was like, oh, there's no price tag on it. Some of us already bought it. It's like on hold or whatever. So I was like, ah, eh, you know, that's fine, whatever. It's so cute, but I'm just not going to get it. So then walked around, did some shopping, and then checked out, was about to leave, and I saw that the chair was still there. And I was like, Ugh, it's so freaking cute. Do I get it or not? And then I was like, no, it's already taken. I mean, there's no price tag on it. So we just started walking out, walked to the car, and then I told Edgar, I was like, 
oh my gosh, I keep thinking about that chair. I was like, can you do me a favor? Can you go ask them if they're selling it? And so he ended up going inside. They're like, oh, well, there's no price tag on it. Someone must be carrying it around and blah, 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 or whatever. So they made an like an announcement over the intercom and it was like, whoever has the price tag to this chair, please bring it to the front counter so you can get your, yourself checked out, blah, blah, blah. And then nobody came. And then they waited a little bit longer and no one came. And they're like, well, the chair is yours. And I was like, oh my gosh. And I need to show you guys, like, look at how much this chair is originally. Again, so freaking crazy. And I got it for like 30 bucks. And I'm so happy with it. I'm so excited for it to go into our new home eventually, whenever that happens. So that's, I guess, pretty much it. I got so many good Target wins or Target Goodwill wins. So many thrift shopping wins. If you guys like watching these videos, please let me know. I love like seeing the comparison of like what I buy at a thrift store versus what it is like in store, which is, I just, I just love it so much. But yeah, thanks for watching as always. And I hope you guys have a good one. Bye.